Hello, this is for Taurus. How are you guys doing? It seems like it's been a long time. <laughs> We're going to get entwined with your message, Taurus, when it comes to your relationship with your person. This could be someone that you're with, someone that you are separated from. So let's just get entwined with the energy and see what we have for you today for Taurus. Energy. What's the energy for Taurus? Angels, ancestors, our highest divine of the Savior. What is the message for Taurus? Thank you. Wow, three of cups. Let's see here. Wow, we have a few. We have the Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, and we have this Page of Cups. Okay, so I feel like you guys are in a form of moving forward in this relationship. There's a lot of investment, a lot of moving up in the ladder. I feel like this person is always thinking about you. That's the energy that I'm seeing here, especially when it comes to um, a stability of the relationship but there's some egoness happening here with this person it's like when they're wrong they don't want to say I am sorry and that is a problem for you all right so let's see we have the five of swords here yeah they tend to do things out of character and I feel like the, the things that they're doing is quite harsh and I feel like a lot of the times when they speak to you is kind of cold as well. So this is the action that they take place and they keep going like they want to win at all costs. And you're just like, I feel like this kind of scares you, you know, like when this person does this in a five of swords, like, wow, how far are you going to take this? You know, and they really will take it to the, the, the all the way up. And I feel like something happens within their head where they're like, OK, enough is enough now. I need to just stop doing this and then they kind of retreat back to you um and you're just like wow the damage is already done though you know kind of vibe but i feel like you are tired of this this form of action with this person because i'm seeing the four of cups here where you're just like you're ready to see what else is out there for you you know even though you have invested so many things look at that the six of swords are in or the six of swords is in reverse this is a permanent decision that you're trying to make. You have learned from this. Ooh, the star. I'm trying to cover that up. Don't want this nudity. Okay, don't want this nudity from YouTube. All right, so we have the two of cups. Talk about the strength between you and this person. What a love. What a love between you and this person. Yeah, somebody might be pregnant if you're not very careful. I'm seeing the Empress here, so um, and the love between you and this person is definitely, you know, a good one. You guys are feeling the same between each other. I feel like again, there's so many things that happen between you and this person when it comes to transformation. So why am I hearing this? This is a cycle. You guys break up, get back together kind of vibe. Then we have the King of Cups here. It's like this person, you're moving towards a new beginning or a new path with this person. But at the same time, it's like after you left, you kind of like you turned it back around. Like the universe turns it back around. It's something that you need to learn from this energy. They're looking at you as the Empress, which is really good. Okay. Yeah, there's a conflict. You guys, there's a conflict here. The angels want you guys to figure things out together. Um, you feel like you're not strong enough for this for, so, for, for some reason. Like, you just don't want to go through this process. Like, it, it is what it is. This is what you're telling people. Like, it's over. There's no balance here. Like, this person stole from you. This person scammed you. This person's manipulative. <laughs> they con you. Um, tell me more. Because I'm seeing a lot of loss here. And I'm seeing, like, this huge form of 
um, communication that is not happening between you and this energy for some reason. So we have Virgo, Scorpio's energy, Major Energy Aquarius. We have Leo also showing up for those of you. Some of you going single. This is what this is all about too. We have Justice here with Libra. So yeah, this person was treating you unfairly here. You're taking back your power. You're going single. A lot of friends are taking you out. You're investing in yourself and the Seven of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles. This person is always thinking about you and trying to find a way to apologize, but they're just not. They're just, they can't do it. This is not in their character because they love to take things on a whole nother level. And I feel like this person often tried to blame you for taking responsibility. You know, they want you to take responsibility of the situation. This is what I'm feeling here. And enough is enough. Like you're done with this kind of life. You're done with this kind of energy. Um, you want something more. You want someone that you can actually give your King of Cups to. Like you want to be able to move on within Scorpio. This is what I'm seeing, like something happened here. And you're like, you deserve this. Look at how you're coming. This person knows your worth too. So they're trying to like play you or play you down and make you feel like you are not, you know, that person. But the truth is you are that person. And this person is trying to, you know, like diminish that. But I feel like you're very smart. Um, you know what you want and you're not ready to talk to this person because this person have took a lot of money from you and you're to get in your it's like I'm seeing like you guys try to build a foundation together like a family the ace of pentacles so you guys could have been married with this two of cups here and this ace of pentacles the justice is also showing up so there's some court issues that you might be going through with this energy and you're going to be fine you're going to be fine look at how beautiful you look glowing i mean oh my god nine of pentacles such a powerful card a lot of you are going to be experiencing life again you're taking back your power from this person and you're making preparations to do that that's crazy you know so this person needs to should have treated you the way that they wanted to be treated and they gave you the four of cups and that's just like okay how are you gonna give the empress the four of cups make it make sense right so tell me more for this energy Okay, so they're saying you're going to meet a Cancer very soon, someone highly emotional. Okay, this person is saying there's Scorpio. Look, we have Scorpio's energy here. Ooh, I'm discreet, sensitive, super loyal. I'm a Scorpio. So you're, you're dealing with a Scorpio for some of you. Angel of the Luck is also here watching this situation. They're saying you can't control me, and then this is a toxic situation here. Wow toxic situation can i have more just a little bit more what about three more Ooh, this is a cycle between you and this person and it's ended it's an ended cycle <clears throat> okay and then we have losing hope losing faith like within the star it's funny how the star is here though there's still hope, there's still faith, there's still, you know, like someone here has that and then someone is like, I'm losing hope, losing faith, period. So Aquarius also coming up here for those of you who are dating Aquarius. All right, so let's see what we have for the energy. Let's see here. Wow, okay, this card. You're so very special. Number 21, <laughs> I feel like that person can tell you that in real life, like only in the spiritual. There is someone else, okay. And then we have, I can't even look at you right now. Mm. So this person is like, there is someone else. Yes. Then we have, I'm coming, trust. Let me hold you. This person wants to hold you. I feel like a lot of you moved on with your lives. This is what I'm hearing. I'm moving on. And they're like, damn, they want to be able to hold you, but someone is in the way. Or this person could be with someone else, but I feel like mostly it's someone that moved on. Okay, then you have another one. Do you think about me too? So this person is wondering if you still have feelings for them. I want to start a family with you. I feel like someone is about to have a family if they're not very careful. Gossip only hurts more. So there's a lot of talk here in this connection. There's a lot of talk going back and forth, a lot of gossip. This is what I'm seeing here. Okay. 
You need to be very careful what you say to people, what you share. Tell me more. Wow, door to value. So whatever you're losing in this relationship, just know that you're going to gain back. But I'm also seeing when it comes to the core situation for you guys, you're going to have to probably try to balance that out because this person is very, making it very difficult for you to win. Okay? I'm seeing a lot of loss. A lot of loss. It's like you have to start over, basically. There's going to be a transformation, so hold on. This is what I'm seeing. The storm is coming. Okay, but your angel, your third chakra is also coming up. So there's going to be um, support. This is what I'm seeing, emotional support that's coming towards you. Um, it's going to be a happily, like not a happily, but you're going to have like a fulfilling relationship with your family. This could also be, you know, the end of it all. So I'm just seeing like through it all, you're going to see the rainbow at the end of the tunnel. So right now it's a lot of darkness. You can't see anything, but I feel like you're on the right path, the right track here. For those of you who feel like your 11 11 is off track, just know that your angels are like, no, it's on track. And this is what I have for you guys. I hope that this resonates. If it does, you know what? Like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel. And I'll see you guys in your next reading in, over the weekend. Bye, guys.